So, sample problem number 1. So, the index of refraction of water is 1.333. So, how fast does it travel in water? So, first that we will be doing, let's identify the gauge. So, the index of refraction of water, which symbolizes small letter n, is equivalent to 1.333. And also, one given is the speed of light in vacuum, which symbolizes small letter c which has a value of 3 times 10 raised to 8 meter per second. And for our unknown, so how fast that it travel in water? So this is now the speed of light in water, which symbolizes small letter V. So for our formula, we will be using the formula for index of refraction is equivalent to the speed of light in vacuum divided by the speed of light in the medium which is the water so for us to, to derive the formula so let's let's cross multiply so the index of refraction times the speed of light in water is equivalent to the speed of light in vacuum so divide both sides by the index of refraction for us to cancel out the index of refraction there so the um, the formula for our speed of light in water is equivalent to the speed of light in vacuum divided by the index of refraction. So we're done with the formula. Let's now solve for the speed of light in water. So we can now use the formula as V is equivalent to speed of light in vacuum divided by the index of refraction in water. So we can now substitute 3 times 10 raised to 8 meter per second. That is the um, speed of light in vacuum divided by the index of refraction of water which has a value of 1.333. So the speed of light in water, we can now have a value of 225,056,264.1. What is the unit? It's meter per second. So there, that's for our sample problem number one.